want you to know, Chaz, that I uh -huh. have uh, played through the whole game again, so you have more. No, no, no. Oh no, yeah, we're like right here. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, um, and we are going to get an extra couple things because okay. I decided better. Um, I want, I want guns. I want okay. guns, Chaz. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe I'll take the quick draw army. Okay. <laughs> what, what? We're going to be like, I don't know. Not Holy shit. How do we have 43 high caliber handgun things? Uh, 43? You mean 12? No, 43 is a large caliber handgun, not the high powered rounds. Uh, Well, I mean, it's better than you'd think, but. No, I mean, that's really good. I'm I'm surprised that we have this much this many Shit. resources based on how many times you've died so far. Well, I mean, I just assumed yeah. that we had low low resources, but in fact, you just aren't very good at the game. <sighs> <laughs> how brutal way to start this episode, Jesus God! Uh, well, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, we can tell if you're good or not based on how much you ace this first uh, fight. I think I'm gonna ace it. In fact, I predict zero hits. Zero hits. Wow. Yeah. And so it's one thing when they're in like the museum, not the, the X museum, like it's stupid, but okay. To use the they evil pendant. They built this <laughs> into Got it. the science zone. Because who was the guy who made the original Umbrella Mansion? Uh, uh, Spencer. Spencer. Uh, Spencer. He was a crazed architect. So did he also design? Because it looks like he designed this. Because <laughs> like, yeah, this is not the work of a scientist. This is the work of like an evil magician. I agree. Oh man, this is a great Anything fight else. coming up. It I, is a great fight. Are we up. shinier? Did we get shinier? I think we're just getting more light than previous. I guess that's true. I think it's the same amount of, of shine. Well, well, well. I'm Birkin. Hey, so I'm T Rex arm. I have a tiny T Rex arm, and I'm not good at stuff. I suck. Showed up. <laughs> yeah. Blam! One shot. Perfect. Hundred percent. S plus plus plus. So, so if only just, I had just one of reload. those. Reload. Yeah, I know. Like, <laughs> like a, a compact, easy to carry handgun that instantly kills the most powerful bioweapons. Yeah, right. And why did? So, if they had this in 1998, yes. why in 2018 during the events of Resident Evil 6 are they running around with just stupid machine guns? Well, okay. No, you're you're really underselling the weapons in RE6. My understanding is that you have an antimatter rifle. And yet it's still less effective than the janky like retrofitted flare gun. I I well, uh, okay, actually I don't know. In RE6 the one I'm talking about, I don't know if the retrofitted flare flare gun can take on the Colossus. Oh, the guy that transforms into a T-Rex and then back into a guy. He turns back into a guy? Yeah, which is where it gets real crazy, because up at, at no other time in the series has someone gone back from being a giant <laughs> monster. But he's like this weird southern looking dude with one of those like little necktie doubles who's like a white suit who just transforms into a T-Rex and then back into a guy for a second. And I think I think it's very briefly back into a guy. Oh, oh no, I shouldn't have stopped. I should have shot two or three more acid rounds into this thing. Yeah, that's brutal. Like, yeah. this game has, like, I think three of those sort of, like, slammed into the walls where it's just like, ooh, those are, that's internal bleeding right there. Yeah, that's, that's rough. Oh, nope, now he has, oh, no, his little arm has disappeared. Little T-Rex arm. Like, why didn't, it didn't work the first time, so why isn't the second time going to work? Well, I mean, that's fairly effective. Though I think that's the same animation it does when I shoot it with acid rounds. Yeah. So maybe it's not as effective anymore. Oh, is this just supposed to be just acid? Uh, I think so. I think so. So, or maybe some thing. Oh, did you see those little racer boots? <laughs> Anyways, I really like that Leon in this scene. She kind of pushes him onto it, and he's like, "What are you doing?" And then Claire's like, "I've got this." And it's like, Claire, what are you doing? <laughs> Good shot. Thanks. An acid. Huh, I guess that is pretty effective. Oh yeah, dude. It hates it. Oh, he has to. Oh, oh boy. Having a little bit oh, of a, geez. a pathing issue over there. <laughs> so, no, just, just stay right there. Stay right there. Don't go forward. Uh, oh, I figured it out. Okay. He solved our puzzle. 
Okay. Neat, neat. Okay, now you, get, you have the knife, right? I do have the knife. Okay, get in there. Oh shit. No, you're not knifing. There we go. If it bleeds, we can kill it. <laughs> no. Rapidly reload, reload. Oh god, reload. You know, when someone's able to aim competently, like these bosses really. Oh fuck. Oh, I really oh look, up there. you're a hit. That's not a hit. That's totally a That's hit. That's not a hit. Look, I didn't take damage. You had to use a defensive weapon to block the hit. No, that. Which means you got a hit. That's the opposite of a hit. I don't think that's true. That was totally a hit. Oh, oh shit. Oh, it's all falling apart now. Dude, fucking... Acid? Grenade launcher. Yeah, acid! <laughs> <laughs> Let me just expose my weak point. So I did not realize until I fought this guy like three times what he was even doing there. Because he just exposes his weak point, and then you just blast him once. Oh, absolutely. Oh, he's gonna do a big leap. Or is he? I, I My whole plan is to use pretty much all my acid rounds. So what's happening there? Is he releasing, like, smoke to make it more difficult to shoot him or something? I don't know. I, I think it's like he's evolving so fast that there's, like, steam rising out of his body, which actually sounds really cool. That, 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 that is not Shit! Cool. <laughs> Hit. That's not a hit. That was a hit. I took no damage. You took damage. Name one time I ever took damage in any game we've ever played. Oh man, see episodes one, three, four, and five. Fuck. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be a hit. Oh no! God, I'm good at games. Holy well, shit! Well, I mean, we established that that's inaccurate because you took a hit earlier. You got better. Uh, okay. There we go. Oh, it's your last shot. Don't fuck up. Ah, fair enough. God, I'm good at games. Better than broken is at least. Oh no, I'm super dead. He's little knife in space. Oh god, I wonder if I can go get that. Wow, that's that's great that it keeps that there. Yeah. Oh, I can totally get my knife back. <laughs> well, that that's intended so you don't lose your diamond knife. Oh, <laughs> so so all knives you use come back. I yeah, I think you are correct. Because that was my question. I was like, so if I accidentally use this on a guy, is it gone forever? No. Okay, great. It luckily infinite durability. I don't remember which uh, little nooks forward in which there are well, items. Even the so. items. Uh, each of these bigger areas. So this is the B, right? Do you say the B? Yeah. This oh, is the oh, B yes, route. yes, yes. Uh, okay, cool. I just wanted to double check in case uh, for the additional things after this. You're going, yeah, you're going to see some stuff that you haven't seen before. So many things. Run, you have space. Wow. I mean, things that I did see before in 2000 uh. and like two, but. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, but again. Uh, I think a flashbang is better than a knife. Oh, but that knife has blood on it. Like G blood, which makes it like the most valuable knife in <laughs> existence. Yeah, is the, but is the blood the sample? I don't. I guess not. You can synthesize it from there. Oh, that's kind of cool. Needle cartridges? Uh, I think I'd rather have needle cartridges than this uh, flash grenade. Huh. Um, but would you rather have have needle cartridges than a knife? Yes. <laughs> okay. Are you gonna use the the needler? Uh, yes, so actually, I am going as to. From now on? Yes. Believe it or not, I will. What about a grenade? What? A <laughs> Damn, a grenade does seem better than two high-powered rounds. Can you throw it? away that? Uh, oh no, you can't. Um, wow, I fucked up by taking too much ammo and shit yeah, into this, didn't I? Yeah. I didn't need to bring the revolver. Revolver. I think that maybe I'll just eat this first aid spray. No, I just toss the two revolver. No. Why would you? Use, when are you gonna use that two re two pistol ammo? What if I need the two? Wait. Wait, what's two pistol ammo? At the bottom it's, left. It's high-powered pistol ammo. I, I don't, I, I don't, do not care. It's, and then, wow, that's, God, that's Would a you shit. rather have like 80 handgun ammo or one grenade? I, mm, well, at this point in the game, I think I'd rather have the one grenade. All right. Uh, Four to the left. Okay, cool. Hmm. Um, I think we should be able to get that S plus still. 
Yeah? Yeah. What's your time? Uh, we're just, uh, 34 <laughs> minutes over. <laughs> hmm, hmm. Yeah, scientists did not make this. Like, do we really... In fact, if these, That makes sense, actually. No, 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 no. If these actually did something, like, I don't know, they they dry you or they're ultraviolet some things or I don't know. Th this would kill you. I don't know what it does to you, but it would kill you. No, I think it exposes you to, like, high levels of ultraviolet light, which will, like... Kill you. Kill some bacteria on your skin. <sighs> Ooh, I wonder if I could go back down there and pick up all that stuff. Um... God, what do I want right now? Don't need that. It's revolver only. Revolver only? No, final destination. <laughs> uh, Chaz, you funny, funny man. <laughs> uh, damn it. God, I've, got, I've gotten so much better at inventory management since the last time we played also. Mm. And that's pretty nice. Um, I do want... It should be good. The grenade launcher and flame rounds. I want, like, all my flame rounds. Yeah, fuck it. Uh, that's fine. Ooh, neat. We have our buddy. And who so we didn't want any healing items. I, I, <laughs> I. Uh, uh, now, oh yeah, she's just like here. Or do we need to go back to the? In no, we go to the infirmary. Yes, which is the north area. And stab her face with a thing that makes her explode less. She'll be like, oh, I wish my face wasn't exploding with the G-Virus because for some reason all the people in my life thought it would be fine to just leave me around. <laughs> she becomes immortal, though, so that's pretty cool. Well, I mean, but then she has to, like, you know, deal with her friends and everyone she knows and loves dying slowly. Yeah, but she doesn't really care. Well. yeah, I Because I refuse to believe that it got that much better. Like, that's a good serum. Well, okay, this is also a thing that lets you grow to, like, 30 times your mass. Well, I mean, that's not that hard. Oh, I got better. I was just sleeping, taking a nap. <gasps> From the internal bleeding. <laughs> okay. Stab her with some uh, herbs. Okay. Or a first aid spray. Have her eat a first aid spray. Or, or give her some uh, green herb ice cream. <laughs> yeah, it heals you. <laughs> I thought, what a great little... That stupid thing. little thing, yeah. Did we show that? I hope we showed that. Um... I think we initially did, but then you skipped and did stuff over the intro and got all weird. So I don't know if they saw it. Or I, not. God, I, yeah, that's that's my fault for making the intro video She's weird. Not, not a certain somebody screaming left and right about the mummy. No, that was fine. Now I'm talking about when we had the audio issue. Wait, oh, audio issue? Yeah, we had an audio issue with like the very first episode, so we had to go back through the first part. And I think we made the joke the first time, but not the second time. Oh yeah, that was totally my fault and failure, a hundred percent. Uh. <laughs> Anyway, so Annette's dying, and it's very sad. And we're supposed to feel bad for her? What happened to her? I mean, I do feel bad for her in the sense that... She shouldn't have done any of this. A monster literally of my own creation. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost as though she groomed her own husband to be a sort of, like, death machine. Well, not machine. And like the cat, I think they're much worse people than they're presented here. Oh, Brooke is presented as like a tragic hero. She's presented as like, oh man, your life is what's important now. It's like, well, uh, no, you're both monsters. <laughs> you're right, we can't. Let's be sad. It's like, well, I you mean, worked for Umbrella, knowing explicitly what you were doing. But it's you not know, like an Otacon, like, oh no, I wanted to make rockets to go to space. Yeah, no, are, even Otacon's an asshole because he knew he was going to a government facility to make a walking tank. He just wanted to make a tank like in his animes. <laughs> That's his motivation. It he is. wanted to make Robocop. It, he, it is. Not and, Robocop. and he just Robo so happened to find like miscellaneous Russian plans that would let him do that. Like, whoops. Like really, uh, really unadvanced ones that were that are much worse than the ones they had in the '80s, apparently. Yeah. Where they had a laser sword. Remember, there was a laser sword, and Saw Lanthropus had a transforming. Mode? Dude, it wasn't even a laser sword. It was a laser whip, which I think is the next step beyond laser it, sword. It was, was just stupid. Yeah. I remember reading about that uh, Wookiee Jedi who who uses a laser whip. <sighs> it's so fucking yeah. Or a light whip. Or I. It what? was called a light whip, and the stupid. Death and Miri witches used them too. And I don't understand. <laughs> that, that's your little, little, pe little peck. It's almost like she was taking like a tiny little bite. Like, I, that's weird. I made that so weird. 
No, what? I mean, I mean, there are zombies. It's normal. It's in universe. We're about that, Peter. We gotta hurry now. We have to hurry to the Let's race. <laughs> <laughs> I have the podium on my mind. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna win that mushroom cup. <laughs> Yeah, like it's let's rank four now. You, well, so you need to be clearance level four to leave the facility. There was something I was gonna get. What was it? Well, I guess I might as well save it. But there's another hand grenade. Oh, it was a knife. And then, yeah, no, I'm not gonna. Well, oh fuck! But no, you're totally right. Okay, all right. No, I do need. I do need to be ready for the boss. Okay, so okay. I should get rid of these healing items. Um, that was a joke. So we're actually going to swap this out for... Do you uh, think the regular pistol? Really? Dude, dude, those are high-powered rounds. But they're not large caliber. They're... No, no, they're high-powered rounds. But they're not, they're not large caliber. Chaz, I... You're fucking with me now. Um... The caliber is lower, so they're a smaller bullet. I guess I don't really need any of that. No defensive items whatsoever? Yeah, all right, I'll take a single defensive item. Okay, all right. Okay. That's fair. All three yeah. open slots. Did you get the extra ammo for this needle spark, needle spark gun? You mean the extra ammo that I specifically threw away several incredibly useful weapons for? Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, there it is. Look at that. Okay. Right, right, is there a needle push. weapon upgrade? Or is it just kind of just needles? Oh, there totally is. Oh, I should go get that. Mm -hmm. Actually, I don't know where it is. I think it's, uh, you have to use the spark generator thing to open up a thing. Well, yeah, usually it's like just over here into the left. Um, but, well, we'll just take a quick detour. We should still be, well. Well, that's not a door that exists. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. Fascinating. Well, you also, guys won't, won't get to see that content. It sure looks cool. Wow, it's so neat. God, it's so cool having access to such cool weapons. Yeah, I'm glad we paused and watched that in another more successful YouTube channel. Oh, God. In, in Persona 3 Dancing, I guess oh, no. has uh, a costume, like a Halloween costume of a sure. Tin Man. Like, oh, that's amazing. And, and she's all like, isn't it funny and everyone's just uncomfortable? Well, okay, so I, <laughs> yes, kind of. But but she um but she has this little voice line when you put it on that goes like, I am a robot. Beep boop boop beep. <laughs> and it's just so fun hearing her go beep boop. <laughs> Anyways, so this is like really cool. Claire? Yeah, it's fire. Yeah. Thank you for being Yeah, just look over here. Don't worry about it, child. <laughs> Um, so going going back to the characterizations of all these characters a bit, mm -hmm. uh, I do continue to think that they did a pretty good job in this game of uh, a lot of the characters. And with the villains, oh god, we gotta switch Leon. Um, oh shit, oh, sorry, one second. What, what what's Leon? We did do ninety eight Leon. Uh, it's gonna be Noir, Arclay, uh, injured. Oh, do Noir, do Noir. Okay, great. Because that means when we last saw him, he was in his police outfit. And sometime between now and then and now, he's he was uh, promoted done his to hair and put on a suit. No, no, no. Between now and then, he he was uh, promoted on the force. And then he <laughs> went renegade and then kicked off the force. <laughs> oh, why didn't we just take one of those with us the first time? I don't know. Here, I'm going gonna, gonna to trim up the volume just a little bit. Mm-hmm. Oh god, there totally is an item box here. But so this is the last item box before the boss is the thing. Uh, yeah, I think it isn't for Leon, but it is for her. Exactly. Like the, you get, like an extra one, and you have like the little piano here, which is cool. Little piano. It, it oh, sounds. Can we, can we set the music to Resident Evil '98? Uh. We should I, be able to. I would, but I actually really like this song. Have you have you heard the '98 version? I have. It's awesome. It's. Not Similar. If you have truly, I, no, I'm, in your heart, and I guarantee our viewers haven't. I well, and well, apparently they might not. God, where am I enjoy going? Enjoy not not having content. Yeah, it's like it's like a, the content is right there in front of you on the table, and Chaz and I are stealing it. No, I'm, it I'm offering it to you, and then and then Tony's throwing it on the ground, and stepping in it. Yes, that's what I would do. That's what you are. That's what's happening. Of course, stupid things locked. locked. Hope no one just like wanders out. Oh yeah, she wanders in and she does a she has a clementine. 
Yeah, she's she's gonna run up on that pipe. Uh, but so with Annette and Birkin, I even though they are like hilariously cartoony villain villains, right? Uh huh. Um, I I do like that they're not necessarily Weskering all over the place. They're absolutely Weskering all over the place. Sorry, sorry, but in comparison to Wesker, they're not. Like they are. I agree. In comparison to which Wesker? Because <laughs> only in five was he truly ridiculous. Fuck you. I just don't like that guy. In one, he was just like a villain. And his goal was to steal the thing and sell it. I find his motivation way more sensible. I need to use these three bullets. I don't know, man. In Zero, him and, and Birkin are watching, being like, Good! This will make great data for our murdering! <laughs> well, I mean, that's... Yeah, that's ridiculous. That's that's one, right? That's zero. Oh, zero. Oh, sorry. But zero came before one, so it didn't, makes that, sense. That did not. No, it, it's zero, then one, Chaz. That's how that works. That's not how that works. Oh, I'm going to have to throw something away. Oh, oh there hey, is a look, box! Another item box. Um. Oh, God. Choose. I don't need that. Wisely. I really don't need that. Oh, this is a carpenter herb. Do you say a carpenter... Hurt? A carpenter's herb. Carpenter's herb. I don't know what that means. It's a Last Crusade reference. I see. 